So during hip flexion, the femur rolls anterior and superior. So to compensate for that, it glides posterior and inferior to keep it in the acetabulum. During hip extension, the femur rolls posterior and inferior. So to compensate, it glides anterior back into the acetabulum. Okay, so for abduction, it rolls superior and lateral. So to compensate, it glides inferior and medial. Okay, so for a deduction, it's going to roll inferior and medial. And so to compensate, it glides superior and lateral. So for external rotation, the femur is going to roll posterior and to compensate, it glides anterior. For internal rotation, it's gonna roll anterior and then glide posterior back into the acetabulum.